Hey everybody, it's JJ Conway. I'm back with some more product reviews. You can find me on the web on social media at JJ Knows the Way. And today I'm going to talk about Amazon's print on demand. So I was looking for a shirt similar to this. And this is an Amazon print on demand. Now I'll tell you right now, I got a little bit offended when Amazon said we recommend a 3XL because this is a medium, all right? This sweatshirt is a medium and I've always been a big girl, but 3XL, now look, now I'm not that old or that big, but that's what Amazon recommended. I guess all these things are being made in China or something. And so that's what I ordered. This is one of the shirts that I ordered and it's a print on demand shirt. This is the only print on demand shirt that I am, that has this design that I've been looking for that I'm keeping and I'm gonna explain why, okay? So let me show you the other shirts that I ordered. This is another one that, that came in and I was, that I saw on the thing and I said, oh, that's kind of neat. And that also kind of goes along with the country theme of where I live now, rural Texas, right? I'm not, a, I'm not in Pittsburgh, shout out to the 412. I'm not in Northern Virginia, shout out to Kingstown, all right? Um, so I said, okay, I'll get that. This is another one of those where Amazon said you probably want a 3X. I'll be honest, this is a little bit big on me. Okay, it's a little bit big on me. Um, but it, but but out of all the shirts, these are the only two that I'm keeping because this one, even though it's print on demand, and you probably can't see it from there, it's a it's it's not a very high quality. Um, um, vinyl or whatever it is that they use it probably won't last for multiple christmas seasons but the fabric feels good and i can wear it to the gym okay let me tell you what i'm taking back okay i was so disappointed because out of all of these this was my favorite one when i ordered it online you know i'm trying to get out of wearing black all the time and so i decided to come out and and try this one again uh, amazon told me i needed a 3x and even though on the camera this seems to look like the same size as the other one but it's actually it's actually so tight that i probably wouldn't wear it without a um i probably wouldn't wear it um just unless i'm just working out but the real reason i'm not going to wear it is because first of all these smell bad these shirts that i'm going to get you they smell bad this one smelled bad too but i aired it out and it's okay these these I air it out and they don't smell okay, all right? And so the other thing about this, if you look at it really closely, okay, wait, look at it closely. Yeah, there it is. You can see, it's kind of hard to see, but there's two lines in it, like as if, as if it's damaged, right? And then it's maybe hard to see on the video, but the, but the, this is puckered. So I'm worried, you know, there's already pieces of it that are starting to come up. So I'm worried that if, if I throw this in the wash, I'm worried that this design will peel, okay? So we're returning this. And then, um, you know, it would be different. It would be different to me if these were $6 shirts, right? But these aren't $6 shirts. In fact, this one was the cheapest one out of all of them. This one was like $11.99. And um, this one, I think, was, was $13.99. And then the rest of them are like $18.99. So the $20 shirts, right? And so this one here, <clears throat> I came across, I said, oh, well, I look good in red. Don't I look good in red, right? Um, I came across this one and, and it's got some weird discoloration going on. And at first I thought, oh, this is like a protective paper or something to protect the design. So then I started trying to peel it off a little bit and the design started to lift. I said, oh, nope, 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 it's going back. All right. Now this last one that I'm going to show you is not a Christmas shirt. Okay, but it is an Amazon print on demand shirt and I was looking for the Christmas shirts and then I started exploring print on demand because I had never seen that before. So, you know, I, I do t-shirt orders from time to time and I go through companies like um, Custom Ink or um, there's another one that I like that, that does really good shirts that we use for Juneteenth Legacy Conference and, um, you know, they're easy to work with. There's some that I've had that aren't that great to work with, but I've had, but, but those, the two that I, the one I can't remember and the custom ink, they've been pretty easy to work with, if not a little bit expensive. And, and I've got a cricket so I can make my own shirts if I needed to, right? But you know, sometimes it's easier to just pay somebody else to do what they're good at doing, you know? Well, my son is into chess. My son, my little one is really into chess. Um, in my last trip to it, he, he met at the Power Networking Conference, he met Mr. Oren Checkmate Hudson, 
who it's, I mean, they played chess all day long. And then when I went to Atlanta, he begged me, please get me some time with Mr. Hudson. So I booked in some time with Mr. Hudson and he is just still on fire for chess. He tied for first place in chess UIL this year. And so whatever, whatever happened this summer is just lit a fire. So when I saw this, I said, oh, you know, you already know I'm coming home with this shirt, right? Because first of all, it's my brand colors, y'all. But second of all, check that out. Black Queen, the most powerful piece in the game, right? And I was very excited to get the shirt. Now, I will say that the shirt fits okay. It's it's a little loose up top, but it covers my, my hips nice. And um, that's hard to find in a shirt, but it... You know, it, it, this is, it was made to sound like a special ring spun, super soft shirt. It is not. And then if you look at the quality, I don't know if you can really see it. it it's supposed to have the distressed look. The distressed look is not the problem for me, okay? Um, what's the problem for me is it's see-through. And it's, it's not coming up very, I feel bad. Like I'm making a review and it's not coming up well on the video. But the, but the, um, but when you look at it, it's very clearly a shirt even without the distress look, that somebody didn't use a thick enough vinyl or whatever to, to cover it. And so they really needed to use a higher quality. And again, if this was a $5 shirt, I wouldn't care so much, but it's a $20 shirt. And I'm going to go walking around town in a shirt that looks like a $5 shirt when I pay 20 for it. I'm not going to do that. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm a cheap person. I don't mind wearing cheap things to the gym and stuff like that. I'm very, not cheap. I'm frugal. But if you're going to sell me something, then sell me what I paid for, okay? And so there you have my review of Amazon's Print On Demand. Um, all four of these shirts came smelling really bad. This one appears to have already been worn. This one is, even though it's got the sticker on it, this one also kind of smells like it's been worn. And then this one, you saw the, uh, you saw how messed up the, 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 the pattern was and then this one you saw how poorly done the pattern was on that so that's why I'm taking those back but overall hey it was a fun adventure and I got to learn some new things and you know what I think I might have to make some of those black queen shirts for myself so if you want one let me know and then and then and know what no matter what I hope you have a wonderful holiday season Merry Christmas to you you can find me on the web if you haven't already subscribe like share and subscribe at JJ Knows The Way on Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, all the things. Except TikTok. I'm JJ Knows The Way Real on TikTok. Because I dilly-dally too long and didn't create a profile when, I sh when it first came out. <laughs> all right, y'all. That's all I have for you today. Y'all take care and be blessed.